Okay, it seems that there's no other way but to get it done. Bye bye everyone, wish me luck. <sighs> Greetings from Mr. Salieri, Biff. We need to know where the cops have got Frank. Sorry, Tommy. I don't know nothing about him. Hey, little Tony. He's like this, with the cops. Better not be lying. How are you, Tony? Mr. Salieri needs to know where the cops are holding Consigliere Frank. And Big Biff suggested you might know something. Hey there, Tom. Uh, look, I don't know uh, the, uh, what the, where, 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 where they've got Frank exactly, but uh, I do know there's a scumbag uh, that's been blurting stuff, uh, something about Frank and the, co and, uh, the cops the other day. Uh, they call him uh, Idiot Joe because he's a complete idiot. He hangs out uh, on the lot under the bridge. Uh, you'll know him. He's completely bald. Great, Tony. I owe you one. Ah. Drive like a maniac. Ah! Ah! Hey! Hey there. You Joe by chance? Got the wrong guy. I'm Pete. Get out of here. Well then, I'm George. Sorry to hear that. Say, ain't you got a twin brother by the name of Joe? My brothers ain't none of your business. Well, I gotta talk to somebody named Joe damn quick. Don't know that fella. I ain't getting through to you. It's pretty damn important. What's important is that uh, you gotta scream. Take it easy. I ain't leaving till I find out where Joe is. That's tough, George. Mom used to always say, Joe, don't go talking to strangers or taking their candies. What did I tell you? Joe. Go screw yourself. I wanna know if the fuzz has got Salieri's, Consigliere Frank, you're my man. What not told you that? I don't know shit. Jeez. Don't try and rile me, Joe. Just remember real quick. Christ! I told you I don't know anything about it, Buck. Just scram. You wanna play hardball, huh? Come on, Joe! You deaf or what? Where's Frank, Joe? Buzz off! Where's Frank, Joe? You deaf or what? Spill it! You deaf or what? Spill it! You deaf or what? Where's Frank, Joe? Buzz off! Ah, uh, you know what? Screw it. Ow! Yeah! Okay, okay, already! You win, man! You win! For Christ's sake, stop hitting me! I'll spill the beans! I'm all ears. Frank and those bastards agreed that if he gave the account books, they'd pack him off to Europe. You better move it. He's probably leaving today. They've been holding him in some joint opposite the tennis courts in Oak Alley. That's all I can tell you. Now leave me alone, you rat. You've been a big help, Joe. Next time, get to the point a bit earlier. The only rat here is you. Lovely houses. <sighs> Looks like I'm at the right place. God damn it.
Why? Jesus, that was close. They must be worried about Frank if they're driving him around in an armor-plated car. Well, I'll follow them and see where they're headed. Sorry, I didn't have time to wait. Why are you standing in the middle of the road? goes uh, I'm gonna hate this mission man he's here mercy don't kill me oh, please spare me Me. Are you actually kidding me? Oh my god. Screw that guy, I hate him. I forgot. I thought, yeah, I did it. No, that stupid moron was with him. There you go. See, he is here, sat. And if I can collect this, I've got more ammo. Bada bim, bada damn boom.
There you are. Oh. How do you like me now? That was a cute attempt. But I'm just too fast. <sighs> you knew huh? this was coming. Frank, the Don sent me. And you know why. I know why. I know. I don't get what happened to you. I thought you were my friend. I'd have never guessed that something like this would happen. Why the hell did you do it? Tom, I couldn't go on this way. Too many people have died lately, and I, I don't have the stomach for it. it. Used to be different with the Don in the old days. Maybe I'm just getting too old. Tom, this is a war, and I don't want to fight anymore. I, I got a child, and I, I thought I'd finally get some peace. You couldn't have done this some other way? You didn't have to sell us out. They came for me, and I had to surrender. They have my wife and daughter, Tom. Oh. If I don't give them the books, they'll kill them. Before, we used to solve things like men. You, Paul, your Sam, would get them back. But I can't take that risk this time. I don't want to lose them, Tom. I can't live without them. They told me if I did what they wanted, they'd release them and send us to Europe. Where we'd start again. Cops? The cops are blackmailing you and want to kill your family? Ever since you and Paulie killed that Billy kid, the cops and Morello have been working hand in hand. The counselor, that kid's father, got where he is thanks to Morello. Morello oh. wanted to get me to talk, and the police would then liquidate the Don. Both sides would then get what they wanted. I'm afraid the situation has changed somewhat. Where are the books, Frank? I haven't got them, Tom. You handed them over already? No. No, Tom. I'll tell you where they are if you get my wife and daughter back. We were supposed to wait here at the airport, so they must be holding them somewhere around here. Come me after if you want. Just make sure they get out of this city alive. Fine. But you'll have to give me those books first, Frank. Sorry, but they're in case you're lying. God damn it, man. I'm so dumb. Uh. Send someone here quickly. We heard shots, and we thought it'd be better to stay inside. I don't know what to do. They must be some kind of hoods. Uh-huh. Okay. But hurry. Are you Frank's wife? <gasps> you come to save us! I am indebted to you! Where is Frank? He's here. Wait here, I'll be right back. They're okay, Frank. Come with me. Alright, follow me, hurry. Don't think anyone's coming. Come on, in here. Daddy! Frank! March. Oh, good gr Alice. Thank God you're alright. Darling. Thanks, Tom. Health! They promised they'd give me plane tickets when I gave them the books. Those tickets must be here somewhere. Could you try to find them? Okay, I'll do that, Frank. Wait here for me. I hope you ain't planning no funny business. I found that funny. It's like this emotional, you know, thanks and everything, mate. Hell! <laughs> ah! Is it plane tickets? I don't know, would that be down in there? Why is that guy still standing there? Uh-oh. 
Adios. Gotta leave. There we go. Oh, they're out the front. Okay. Oh, happily ever after, I'm guessing. Here you go, Frank. Thanks, Tom. Let me say goodbye to March and Alice, and then we'll sort out this what? business. What? Frank, you want flying with us? What? I can't. What? Watch. Tommy and I have a very serious situation here that we must sort out. Right, Tom? Frank, just tell me where the books are and go with them. What? How would you explain it to the Don? Aww. Forget about it. That's my problem. Where are the books? I'll never forget this. Here's the key to a safe box in the First National Bank downtown. The books are there. Take it, Tom. Thanks. And Tom... Thanks for everything you've done for us. I'm indebted to you. And tell the Don I'm sorry for the way things had to end. To the Don, you're dead, Frank. If he finds out you're not, then this isn't finished. Now just go. Tommy, I'll never forget how you helped us. God bless you. Goodbye, mister. Aww. <laughs> and, uh, don't forget what I told you in the car that time. I haven't forgot. Bless him. In the end, your best friend kills you. Frank told me that in the car. And now, it was me who was meant to kill a friend. Only I didn't do it. Don't do to others what you wouldn't want them to do to you, or however they say it. And I didn't want Polly to knock me off anytime soon. <laughs> I may have given him a reason to do just that today. I brought it on myself. Uh -huh. I just hope he likes me as much as I like Frank. Oh, that's so wholesome. The game just shut off. God, God knows where this left us off. Oh! I'll take this. Right. I'm out of here. Fingers crossed this one works. Uh... Oh, thank God. I'm right, because I'm always right. But let's just start check out. Where is he? Hello there, Tommy. Oh. How's it going? Fine, and you? I'm great, but some bouncer from Hobo can beat up my buddy. He hangs around a black cat bar. You know, I want someone to go and uh, teach him a lesson. That won't be a problem. You do that, Tommy? 
Oh, that's great. Hey, but uh, don't shoot him. I don't want you to kill him. Just uh, hit him until he begs for mercy. Yeah. <laughs> if you do this, then I get you a real exhibition piece. Sure. What's the scum look like? Ah, uh, he's a real big gorilla. Some character at the Black Cat Bar. You can't miss him. His name's Big Stan. Now you just tell him it's a lesson from Carlo. Okay, I'll go to it. I don't fight gorillas. Is it you? Big Stan? Who wants to know? I've got a message from Carlo. You want to get it like him, or what? No, not me. It looks like today you're in luck. Ah! Oh! Oh! Look at him go! <laughs> okay, we're about to find out what you get when you do one of these missions. So, he uh, learned his lesson? If he doesn't get new teeth, he'll have to eat baby food. <laughs> uh, Carlo will be real happy. So, where's the car? A guy at a millionaire's quarter up in Oak Hill has got it. Ooh. It's a minor technical revolution. Great motor, drives real good. It's a front-wheel drive, you see. Yeah, movie stars drive those cars. That's right. Look at the lock. It's a piece of cake. Uh, but when you go for it, be careful. The guy has some bodyguards. Sorry. Ooh. Lovely car, eh? Bastard, don't touch that car. Oh. Thief! Oh. Police! Oh. All right, knock it off. No, that bastard will kill us all. Screw you. It's just my car now. Welcome to the collection. What did, do you need? What's this one? Is this the vault? Because if it is, I'll get rid of this. Yeah, this one. And the hearse, which I don't know why is here. The Lazater V16 Charon. What the, do you need? Hey, get me more room. Awesome. Visiting rich people. Yeah, for the weekend.